I cough loudly, the sword will break. Oh no. And here she is again, being a nerd. Please do not disturb those. No, I was trying. Century. I was trying to talk to you. Good, you are awake. I was hoping to talk to you. Uh oh. There is nothing to worry about. <laughs> I assure you. You have completed your first field mission. You must have thoughts. I am curious as to what they are. What are you feeling at the moment? Uh, like pizza? Yes, our work is important. Of that, there is no doubt. For some of us, the unavowed is a calling. For others, a duty. But for you, I have seen you in action. I have seen you react under pressure. You were clearly meant for this life. I don't want an entire unlike cut pineapple on my pizza. Oh. I would not say so if it were not true. Your old life, your life on the stage, prepared you for this. The it straight. made your mind flexible, open to new ideas and new ways of thinking. In this day and age, that is more important than ever. Pumpkin spice pizza, woo! There's an idea. We are an ancient institution. We need new energy, new minds, new hearts. The unavowed has been without that for a very long time. <clears throat> At any rate, I detect no falsehood within you. You spoke the truth to me. Thank you. I will return to my training now. All right, nerd. Whoa, what's that? Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. I was just reading some old texts with Fireside. <clears throat> Fireside. Oh, of course. Sorry. It's a fire magic trick. Let's me read any book that was consumed by flame. It's a bit of a strain on the eyes, but beggars can't be choosers. Being a mage has its moments. I won't deny it. Although I can't say the same about this book. It's an old Sumerian text about death magic. Really long, really boring. But I used to read books about S-Corp tax code for fun back when I was an accountant. I can handle boring. Ah, well. See you at the meeting. Pumpkin pasta sauce. Pumpkin spice. Fire away. <clears throat> That's right. Back in my mundane days. Back before my powers came. My mundane in, I worked days. at the firm Weisel, Meltzer, and Sherman. My there mundane days. used to be a bank days. somewhere in the middle of that, but, well... You know. My mundane days. Sure, I guess. You know what they say. If it's yours, put your name on it. But yeah, that's my house. Well, 50 years ago it was my house. Had to leave it behind when my powers kicked in. And the worst part? I was only five installments away from paying off the mortgage. Well, I can't deny that's me. Almost 70 years ago that was taken. Could we not talk about this yet? Yep, that's me. Hard at work. I can even remember the account I was working on. This dress manufacturer in Midtown. Booming business, lots of numbers, tons of paperwork. Took me months to sort through it all. I loved every minute of it. Weirdo. We were feeding the birds. What? You expected something else? There's nothing special about it. Just an ordinary day. Yeah, same. Is it meeting time now? Like, those don't look like words. 
This pumpkin is well, that would not be bad. To send you aid would leave our own domains undefended. You know this, Kalash. Undefended against what? Ours is the only domain under attack. Your charter is quite clear. Recruitment is your responsibility. You accuse me of negligence. Just how many agents are currently in your employ? That is precisely the point. We have no agents to spare. I am sorry, Kalash. So am I, Aralax. New York is getting overwhelmed. When that happens, they will come for you. Then we must be ready when it comes. Aralax out. Major Hanum swallow you whole. Ah, you heard that, did you? Certainly. No doubt about it. It is no secret the threats have been escalating. I had hoped to appeal for aid and fill up our ranks. Alas, we are on our own. I respect Lady Aralax, but I should have known better. Never ask a dragon for anything. You will always regret it. Hmm? A magic phone? I suppose that is one way of Magic describing it. Magic bone! There are shards of this crystal in every branch of the unavowed. It allows us to communicate, for whatever good that does. A dragon at the head of the Dublin branch of the unavowed. Yes, she is old, stuck in her ways. I suppose the same could be said of most of us. Yes, duty calls. <laughs> duty. I have appealed once more for aid. It has been rejected. Huh. This is my surprised face. Why do you bother with those cowards, Father? Show some respect. They are correct. Stubborn, but correct. Only to a degree. The rules are clear. Each branch is responsible for its own defense and recruitment. In this respect, I have been negligent. So have all the branches, Father. A sudden rise in threats would have caught any city unprepared. And we're that city. Lucky us. I shall appeal again, rest assured. In the meantime, let us go over last night's events. fine to me. As for the others, daughter, I trust you have recuperated from your ordeal with the fire elemental. I have. There do not appear to be any other ill effects. So you aren't entirely positive? I took all the necessary precautions, but one is never entirely positive. Then I will have to accept that. However, I am deeply concerned that this mundane was able to acquire such a powerful spell in the first place. Yes, but why? Why would a demon do such a thing? Why do demons do anything? To create havoc, obviously. Demons! Why else? No, this was too focused, too targeted. We are not dealing with a mindless spirit bent on chaos and destruction. This demon had a plan, a purpose. We need to learn what it was. Funny you should say that. Ah, I knew that look. You did as I asked, Mage Beckett? Yes, I did, sir. And it worked. Well, working. It's not quite done yet. What are you referring to? Oh, the ritual knife. I did a thaumaturgic scan on it. A thumb of what did the bar? I couldn't be sure until I did the scan, but I did find something interesting. The knife was imbued with a very specific energy signature. Your demon's energy, to be precise. Ah. It's connected to you, and you alone. 
That's why you were the only one who could use it properly. Which means we can track it. Since a butt coming. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I can track the energy signature, but the demon's out of your body now. Its energy signature has changed. I can only track where it's been when it was in your body. Any information is useful sooner or later. But in this case, it's sooner. It was all over the map. I'm trying to narrow it down to the areas of greatest activity, but it's slow going. So far, the scan's got you pegged in two places. The Bronx, around Gun Hill Station, and Staten Island, by the ferry terminal. Well, you were there, or at least your body was. Very well. Check both Bye. areas for void activity and any sign of the demon. We'll show those idiots on the council what New York is made of. Meeting adjourned. The hour grows late and the trail grows cold. Think about today. Eli, you are tapping me. Pure. Into the I am. Clear. Sweet. Pure. Yes, it is quite aggressive. You only need one huh. mall. Mine must have wandered. Left. Sorry, Simply stop. fashion. Thank you. I can't read this one. It says, I see professional. To make it happen. I don't know. Alright, we can go to... Let's go here. Staten Island. It's all rainy. I don't have any... Spe I don't have any secret powers. I know that song. Uh, Lowlands Away, isn't it? Yes, an old. Oh! Here we go. Summoner, you have made a grave error. Return me to my world immediately. Release me! Send me back! You summoned me in the middle of battle. I am the general commander. Without me, my soldiers are doomed to failure. It matters not. They are under my command. It is no secret our efforts are going poorly. Perhaps even futile. They poison our waters. They destroy our resources, our hopes, our lives. So we fight. Outnumbered and outmatched, but what choice do we have? We choose to live. If you have counsel to offer, I am listening. Was that... One of the merfolk? I cannot say for certain. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, take it easy. Yes, try and get your bearings. Ow, ow, ow. You can ow. lean over the rail if you need to, you know, throw up. I guarantee nobody will notice the smell around here. It's also rain. You seem all right. Good. One of the merfolk, yes. The demon summoned it. But how? To open such a path takes tremendous energy. Energy that a demon alone should not possess. Such a thing is impossible. And yet, I spoke it, so it must be true. Yes, and the less you express your surprise at every supernatural encounter, the faster we can get on with things. Speaking of, let us venture forward. We will learn nothing standing here in the rain. I just made a statement! Man, stop being a butt!
That's crap and you know it. Keep your voice down. Oh, I'm sorry. Wouldn't want to embarrass you. Jesus, V. It's not that. You can't be here. Everyone already looks at me funny. Can't you just stop? People are dead. How many are gonna pile up before you do something? It's a tragedy, Vicky. That's all this is. Right. Sure. I'm getting a drink. See you around, Donnie. Bye. Bye. Hey, it's Donnie. Huh? Sorry. I was a bit distracted. Nobody. You didn't see me with anyone. Shit. I mean, crap. Damn it, Vicky. Why do you have to screw up everything? Don't tell anyone, okay? I'll never hear the end of it. With Vicky, there's always a problem. And that's all I'm gonna say. I guess I am. You ever play Trollgate? It's like digital crack. I created a character when I was like Troll 16. Game. They got me hooked for life. That sounds like George's favorite game. Yep, saving up to buy a car. Until then, I ride the bus with the plebes. Could be worse, at least cops ride free. Right, see you. I have nothing to say. Don't know what I'd say. Vinny, come on. You and me, we go back. You think I don't know that? But you keep bothering people. You keep bothering me. She was your wife, you asshole. It was a tragedy, Vicky. That's all it was. You're serious? Dead ass serious. Now leave, Santina. Well, screw you too, buddy. Did you hear that? Again with the just a tragedy. Yes, the deadpan delivery. Why is this why is this unlocked? That's really the question. Why is it why is this place unlocked? I got I got <laughs> another ghost and in a back alley no less. Whoever this was, they are beyond our help. I know. Ignore the ghost. I get it. Looks like we can try as many combinations as we want. Eli, I have been meaning to ask, how are you coping? Huh? I'm coping fine. Why? Until recently, we have only entered the field once or twice a month. Now we are out almost every day. <coughs> one, one, one. Well, where'd I go? Hey, new faces, all right. Come on in, dry yourself off. And you, 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 uh... Vodka Mar... Vinny's Vodka Martini. Hey, uh... <clears throat> my name's on the sign. Uh, so you are Vinny. You're a sharp one. So I have been told. Ha, <laughs> I like you guys. Oh. Sorry you had to see that. Vicky and me, we go back. I help her out where I can, but there are limits. If you don't know, I probably shouldn't say. You guys are obviously not from the neighborhood. 
<laughs> your accent's not bad. You could pass for a local, but no. Vicky's an old friend, and a good cop once upon a time. I ain't betraying that. Even if she has become the neighborhood nut. It was a tragedy. Yeah, it was a tragedy. That's all it was. It was a tragedy. That's all it was. It was a tragedy. <laughs> You've seen her around. You know what I'm talking about. She skeeves everyone out. The cops want nothing to do with her. Even her own family's ready to write her off. I said enough. Sorry. Um, hey, that guy? You okay? I'm fine. It's just what you said. To turn away from your own family. It's the hardest thing in the world. Could be. Vicky made it easy for him to say that much. It was a trade. I ain't going anywhere. Stab him with a sword. I have nothing to say. Hit him with fire. Know what I'd say. Alright, well, I don't know if we got any info, but I don't think we can do anything else in here. That man, Vinny, did his emotions read a bit false to you? <clears throat> You're not wrong. His wife died. He's been brainwashed not to think about it. He should Strange. be grieving. He needs to be grieving. It's just what you do. Tragedy. So he's like the others. There are no others. Janie, this is rotten and you know it. It's a tragedy, Vicky. That's all this is. God damn it. Forget it. I'm going for a walk. Come talk to me if you want to do your damn job. Hey, it's a body. Sorry, sir. You shouldn't be here. You need to leave. Is that still in business? I'll cooperate as much as I can, but I can't tell you much. This is just a tragedy. A senseless tragedy. Vicky? Nobody. Stay clear of her if you know what's good for you. It's a tragedy. Just a tragedy. A senseless tragedy. It's a tragedy. That's all this is. Neighborhood nut. You been talking to Vinny? Look, she's going through a rough patch. No question there. But you can't talk about cops that way, suspended or not. It's about respect. You did not seem very respectful when you spoke to Vicky yourself. That's different. I'm a cop. Yeesh. Word gets around, don't it? I think it's easy for the Santinas. They're a cop family to the bone, going back a hundred years at least. Getting suspended like that had to be a blow. It doesn't matter. You don't turn away from your family. I won't argue there, but in Vicky's case, I think it was mutual. Her folks had their anniversary barbecue last month. Vicky was there. Things went down. Wasn't pretty. Like I said, it was for her folks' wedding anniversary. I don't know what went down, but the neighbors had to call the cops. Which, as you can imagine, made things a bit awkward at the next briefing meeting. It's... Let me guess. A tragedy? A tragedy. That's all this is. I suggest we stop this line of ink. She is obviously the victim of mental manipulation. Sure. Please... I asked... Why do you keep asking about that? It was her folks' anniversary. We cops were called in. It was... Why do you keep asking... I think it's getting to... It doesn't... I won't argue, but folks... Why do you keep... Why do you keep asking... Right. Sure. Alright, I guess we go back this way. I think we're following, uh... Go up this Seriously? Here. It took forever to get here. No, oh, we're not done yet. Okay. the police station? Yes, we can. Oh, it's just pictures. I thought 
how we can make people look. Yes? What is it? Are... Sorry. I thought you looked a bit familiar. But no. It was just a trick of the light. A useful skill to have, in my line of work. In any case, while I'd love to chat, I have a mountain of paperwork to get through. Unless there's something else I could help you with? <sighs> Is she bothering my officers again? That woman just can't let things go. What's to tell? She used to be one of my finest detectives. Now she's not. I feel for her. I really do. But until she gets the help she needs, she needs to stay out of our way. Now, unless that's all... Mental help. The kind you need a PhD to prescribe medication for. She refuses to get it, and it's only making her condition worse. Heaven helps those who help themselves, as they say. It's out of my hands. I do not gossip about please take your idle specu- Captain Joy Harrison, at your service. Filling out paperwork, a specialty. Yes, well, if you'll excuse me. Hey, she, she, she thought she recognized me. <coughs> Which I think is interesting. I have nothing. Don't know what I'd say. All right. Evening, sir. Turned against her? Who said that? I haven't turned against her. Wait, you're related to Vicky? Fine. Now you know. She's my sister. I'm not trying to make a big deal out of that, okay? Vicky's been nothing but trouble ever since she got shot. Right in the shoulder. It was during that nightclub shooting last year. Vicky was the only one to get out alive. That kind of thing is bound to mess anybody up. But Vicky isn't Vicky anymore. That's just it. We don't know. She just got weird, angry, all the time, twitchy, paranoid. She keeps bothering people with questions, trying to solve cases that we closed a long time ago. Just tragedies. That's all they are. Each of them, just a tragedy. She's a Santina. That name still carries some weight around here, at least until she takes it too far. Which she will, the way she's going. You sound almost ashamed of her. Your own sister. Hey, man. You think I haven't tried talking to her? Tried to get her counseling? Whatever? She won't listen. I feel bad for her, but she's gone somewhere none of us can follow. I'm not getting dragged down with her. And that's a fact. If she wants to live in Vinny's crap basement, that's her business. See, that's the kind of crap I'm talking about. My parents do a barbecue every summer for their anniversary. All the neighborhood cops go. So, of course, Vicky has to show up and cause a scene. Gets into a screaming match with Captain Harrison. I mean, THE Captain. They almost threw hands. I get that Vicky went through a lot, but you just don't do that. Yeah, since her severance package ran out, that's all she can afford. All of us Santinas are cops. Our dad, grandpa, my two big brothers. It's a family thing. At least, until now. Like I said, it's just a tragedy. A tragedy. That's all it is. I told you. Vicky and the cap... Right. All right. See you. <clears throat> well, now we know where she lives. Is this what the old days were like? So she lives here, I think. I just don't know the code. <clears throat> right? A number that's significant to her. When did she get shot, for example? So I think we're just gonna go around talking to people until we find out the information. Hey, uh... Yeah, I never used the room, so I rent it out sometimes. The door's got a keypad lock. 
But since I let the Renner choose the combo, there aren't any problems. Evan Vicky down there is awkward as hell, but what can I do? Let her live in the street? As long as she uses the alley entrance and doesn't bother my customers, we don't have a problem. She's never home. She only comes home to sleep. What she does all day is her own business. Um, no? What a thing to ask. Why would I let you do that? Huh. I'm impressed she has any friends left. Still, I can't help you. You can wait in here for her if you want. And why would I let you... Alright. Like I said, I couldn't even get yet. I ain't going anywhere. I asked you to leave. I suggest she is obvious. Sure. Okay. I think we're gonna we're gonna just ask about things until we get a significant date or something, and that'll probably be it. Yes. Everyone's a gossip, aren't they? Yes, it's true. It was my fault. I shouldn't have risen to her. But Vicky has a way. She gets under your skin, needling you until you snap. Useful on the job, not so much in civilian life. What did you argue about? You might have noticed she's been acting erratic. So she was asked specifically not to come to the party. She came anyway. She took a handful of the party invitations and burned them on the grill. I've never seen anything so petty in my life. So I tried to make her leave. She was looking for a fight. I almost gave it to her. I should have known better. I do not gossip about- Please take your- As I said, Vicky- She took a hand- Yes, well. So when was she shot? What what day was it? Evening, sir. I told you. Like I said, that's all that. Who said that? <sighs> right. Okay. What is the cut? Well, what what's in here? Like, this is interesting. Like, why can we even go come in here? A card reader. Oh. Hmm, interesting. I bet you we're gonna get a card. I bet you we're gonna get a card in her in her place. to know what the code is. What's the code? I fail to see. Um. What is the code? How do we get the code? <coughs> Hey, yeah. Uh. And why would I... There aren't any more... I told you, it's just a bunch of tragedies. That's all it is. And why would... You sound as crazy. Nothing is going on. It's just a tragedy. And what? She was a, a tragedy. That's all it was. Stop trying to make this more than it is. It was a tragedy. I ain't going anywhere. Alright. He, he said he doesn't have the code anyway. Like, even 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 if he he, he but but the, I don't believe that. I have a hard time believing that. Unless he he must know how to change the code. I asked. 
sure. Evening, sir. Like I said, that's all that I told you. Right. Hmm. Well. Yes? I do not please to... As I said, she took a handful... Yes. Anybody know what the code is? Because I don't know what the code is. And I feel like we're missing something. What else can we do? What's up? Okay. Sure, but maybe we should get away from the mundane. Okay. You know my powers are at your disposal, right? You need anything roasted? Right. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. I, I think I got it. I think I, I think I figured out what we're supposed to do now. What's up? Sure. Sure. Just a sec. June eighteenth. <clears throat> Seems pretty typical. I used to host a bunch of pack horse these days. I would. What's up? Sure. Right behind you. What's up? Right. There's a date we need in. The smell. Quite unpleasant. Be sure of one thing, Dantini. You are not insane. You are not the one who's crazy. The key is to look under the crazy. Don't forget. <clears throat> we are deeply just saddened to inform you that your position at the Staten Island Police Department is suspended due to your violation of our office code, code of contact, conduct, section 3. We have no choice but to end your employment with us effective immediately. Please turn in your badge and associated IDs.
shoot to pieces. Found on Doc missing four days. Heart torn out. Brown found in the bathroom missing six days. Throat crushed. Found in the street missing one week. Head bashed in. What did I get? A butter knife. Got the key card. Uh huh. I'm so smart. Let's go. Ugh, what a way to live. You live in a basement too, as I recall. Yeah, but mine's cozy. And my neighbors are less, uh, dead. Don't move. Any of you. Okay, now turn around, nice and slow. Holy shit. It's you, the one who sliced up those actors. Give me one reason why I shouldn't put a bullet in your head right now. You serious? You killed a bunch of people. There was an APB with your picture on it for months. I've been watching you. You've been sniffing around, asking about me, and you were talking to that thing behind you. It's not a thing. It's a human spirit. You think I don't fucking know that? Marlene DeMarco, missing for a week, then found dead in this alley, arms and legs chewed to pieces. There's been no investigation. Nobody even wants to talk about it. Not the cops, not her husband, nobody. Nobody except you. So tell me, what is going on? Like you, don't insult me. Last year, I was in the hospital. This guy named Marino went crazy, started shooting everyone. I took him out, but I took one in the shoulder. Spent a month in recovery. Things were fine, but when I got out, everything was weird. Yeah, weird. Shut up and listen. Twelve years I've been a cop. You think that means something? No, I'm out on my ass. Everyone thought I was crazy. Me, bodies piling up all over town, and I'm the crazy one. Nobody cared. Not the cops I used to serve, not even the victims' families. It was like they didn't even notice. I thought I was the only one, but you guys notice, don't you? Bullshit. Why should I believe a word you say? No. Here's what's gonna happen. We're all gonna march down to the police station. Then you're gonna tell the captain everything. Tell her what you can see. Convince them I'm not crazy. Get them to give me my badge back. That's a really horrible idea. The what? You think I'm gonna join whatever crazy murder cult you've got going on? We are not a murder cult. This man was possessed. He was guilty of no crime. I'm sorry, who are you? I am Mandana. Look, Madonna, I could care less what you guys are. We're going <laughs> to the station. No, we are not. Stay right there. For real? Please lower your weapon. We wish no harm upon you. This has got to be a joke. Drop that thing before you hurt yourself. I am a servant of the unavowed. We are the wall against the oncoming darkness. Final warning. Lower your weapon now. We have vital duties to perform. You are in our way. You asked for it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. 
We need not be enemies. Please, join us. Help us. Perhaps we can help you in return. I want... I just want... I want to be normal. I don't want this. You want to help? Stay the hell out of my way. And stay the hell away from me. Her eyes and mind are closed. She could be a valuable asset, if she would but open them. She would but open them. Alright, let's check, let's check where this key card goes. Key card, key card, key card. It probably goes in a slot. Wait, what does it say? Oh, okay. It goes there. Whoa. You guys must think I'm stupid, don't you? Breaking into my apartment, going through my stuff. I might not have a badge anymore, but I know a Class B felony when I see one. Don't sound so surprised. What did you think was gonna happen? Now sit tight. The cops will be here any minute. No, I told you to leave me alone. Breaking into my storage unit? Kinda the opposite. This will not end well. Trust us. Bullshit. There are laws. There are rules. You guys are spitting on them. Donnie! You got my call, thank Christ. Hello, Vicky. Christmas came early, baby brother. I got three perps in there. Gift wrapped just for you. They're armed, so you should call for backup. Just make sure you get credit for the caller. Um, Donnie? You gonna move your ass, or what? Donnie? Donnie, what the holy fuck? You were killed here. Unknown shooter. It was a tragedy. That's all it was. Donnie, no. A tragedy. Just a tragedy. Donnie, this isn't you. Snap out of it. Just a... Shit. I don't want to do this, Donnie. That panel is embedded in the wall. We will not remove it that way. Alright. Remove it. You saw Old rusty screws are holding this panel in place. I should be able to pry them out. Just one moment. Done. Okay, now I can't see. Oh no, we want to make the door. No, 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 no. Make the door open to be on the sprinkler. There we go. Oh, wait. Wait, what did we. Wait. I, I, guess, I guess we can do that. I don't care about the door closed. So either the sprinkler will door open the door that way or the sprinkler will open the door that way. So then we want to make the sprinklers go off, right? So then we just have this guy sprinkler. <coughs> How did you... Magic. Whatever, just stay back. You'll get yourself shot. Oh ye of little faith. Guns. So combustible. It's safe. You can all come out now. You too, Vicky. Is... is he okay? Oh. He'll be fine. I... Shit. What a mess. I... yeah. I guess I can. I... You I'm nerd. Sorry. You saved my life. Thank you. It's been... A long year, but that doesn't excuse anything. I was a grade-A jerk. Your grade eyes are open jerk, to the truth yeah. now. That is all we can hope for. Grade-A jerk. The truth. Right. Were you really possessed when you killed all those people? It was, wasn't it? This is all crazy, but I believe you. So, are you with us? Someone brainwashed my brother to kill me. You don't mess with two Santinas and get away with it. Vic? Vic? Donnie, 
It was Harrison. Harrison? Captain Harrison? She told you to kill me? How? Why? It's okay, Donnie, but you're sure. Joy Harrison. That Captain Harrison? She said we meet her on her boat when it was done. Said it was a tragedy. Just a tragedy. Harrison, huh? Stay safe, Donnie. Your sister has business to take care of. Uh-oh. You guys coming with me or what? Um, shouldn't someone stay here with Donnie? Sure. I'll make sure he's okay. Right. Thanks. Let's go. I had to make a choice. She's getting away. Move it! Stop the boat, Harrison. That's Captain Harrison. You Santinas. Never any respect. Fuck respect. Stop the boat. And the language. You get that from your father. Although your mother isn't much better. Stop the fucking boat. Whatever you say. Just lower that gun. There. Oh. It's you. You're the actor who slashed up that theater in Brooklyn. Quite the chameleon you are. You've eluded us for months. I should be impressed. I can't exactly judge you. Not after everything that I've done. I have no idea what that means, but it doesn't really matter, does it? He is coming. Who is coming? The General. I met him out here. The General! He gave me this power. The General's coming! Things. I used it to further my career. Convinced old Laputa to take early retirement. I should have known there'd be a price. <laughs> you should get it. Gotta help him write this time I can leave. <laughs> The general. You know of him. Then you know that he needs soldiers. Lots of them. His people can't fight on land, you see. He needs us for that. That was the deal. He gave me this power. I would send him people. For his army. People? Yes. He would send them back, eventually. In pieces, usually. Pieces? Then I would use my new power to cover it up. Not just the police, friends, family, anyone who would question the status quo. He gave me no choice. He would have killed me otherwise. But it could have been worse. The general wanted hundreds. I only gave him a dozen. Yeah, you're a freaking hero. You made me think I was crazy. You made everyone think I was crazy. So tell me, you gaslighting bitch. Why single me out? I don't know. I didn't want to, believe me. Touch your mind. The general's power. You're immune. I'm what? She is void touched, as we are. Your power will not work on us. I knew that as soon as you walked into my station. I knew then I'd have to take action. You sent my brother to kill me. I thought you'd leave, Vicky. Then you just move away in shame after everyone shunned you. But no, you just dug in deep. Instead of moving away, you moved down the block. Typical Santina. Like a dog with a bone. You just won't let go! No, no, it's a general! What the fuck? Silence! Silence! You have returned at last. Do you intend to fulfill your promise to me? Install. You have come empty handed. You instructed me to bond with a human, one with ambition, and they would bring me an army. I have done so, and yet I still wait for an army worthy of the name. So I ask again, where is my army, Sumner? My people continue to get slaughtered by the hour. Lies. Why do you lie? You are the one who summoned me here. You are the one who promised me an army. He is but turn, you just is. toy with me. Why? You play with the lives of my people. Obviously up there is no misunderstanding. Right. Enough of this. 
There's only one outcome here, Summoner. Your death. The blood of my people demands it. You are merely the... Hey. I cannot strike the creature from this range. Is what the general said true? You summoned me here. Nevertheless, the fact remains. If it wasn't for you, we wouldn't be here right now. No, that's not just true! just lucky the general chose me. Anyone else would have seen hundreds dead by now. I hope you... I should be freaking out. I should be pissing myself. What the hell is wrong with me? I am? Maybe. It's worth thinking about. Maybe I belong with you people after all. Throw a butter knife at him. The general is a hardened warrior. I doubt a butter knife will do much damage. Throw a key card at him. Oh wait, we can. I cannot. St I hope. I fail to see him. Oh no, stop! And then it'll like, it'll like, uh, it'll, uh, it'll impale him, right? What the hell are you doing? Okay, I, that did not work out like I was thinking. What the hell are you doing? Mm. What is this stench? Oh, well, if you had Fire Guy, then we'd be good. But we don't have Fire Guy, we have her. So... and that you were taken advantage of. We are not without sympathy. I see. Very well. I accept your terms. I will leave and never return. Yeah, good question. Joy Harrison and I are bonded. She will share my power as long as... Speak up. Can't hear you. As long as I am alive. Right.
Just like that? You'll leave Harrison with this power? There has been enough bloodshed in this neighborhood. Do you agree? <sighs> Fine. Yeah, we're leaving yes. it with power, because why the hell not? With or without an army. Goodbye. I pray we will not meet again. She can't brainwash us. First in your class. Color me impressed. I would never hear the end of it if I wasn't. Still, any father would be proud. There she is. Vicky! Hey, Donnie. Captain, is it true? Did you really order me to kill my own sister? Officer Santino. Answer me! Easy there, Dee. Everything's taken care of. What? Yes, it was a misunderstanding. That's all this is. Yeah, uh, misunderstanding. That's all this is. I'll just go home. I feel not so good. So, what do we do about her? I assume you guys have a magic jail or something? Magic jail? In times past, we had a detainment facility and the staff to maintain it. Sadly, that is no longer the case. Right. Then this is what we're gonna do. Let me guess. You want me to resign? Leave town? Why or is she going join to us? No, you're gonna keep your precious job. What? Excuse me? She you can't us. tell anyone what happened. We can't have you running around either. So you stay here on my home turf. Take one step off Staten Island, I'll find out and I'll come after you. She's got if nice I power! One person acting weird, one whiff of anything hinky happening around here, I'll hold you responsible. I understand. Good. Now get the hell out of my sight. I don't know. So, <clears throat> you guys have a wizard clubhouse got, or something? She's got mine? We have a Brainwashing yes. power. How do we get there? Magic the carpet? Head? No. The ferry, and then the subway. Yeesh. Well, uh, let's jet. The 1005 ferry's leaving any minute. That's a, that's a good power. 